All right, awesome. Coop, you're just not gonna play the field anymore? No. Can't take the heat? <laughs> My name is Anna Louise Owens and I approve this message. I am a first year graduate student in the Masters of Arts and Higher Education program. My leadership position is that I serve as a graduate assistant in the Sierra Offerman Leadership Institute, specifically working with the Leadership Safari program. I think being a leader to me in my position um, is not about as much my leadership. Like innate, there are leadership characteristics and we have to encompass and embody that given the position and the responsibilities that we have. But I think for me it's about guiding undergraduate students that I work with to discovering their own leadership capabilities and how to grow their own leadership skills and learn how to um, kind of continue to foster those skills and articulate them um, as they go out to the world. So it's less about me and what I can do as a leader um, and more so helping them recognize that in themselves. This is amazing and I think it really speaks to a teaching moment, it speaks to your ability to collaborate because it's really hard for two separate people to write something and then put it together. I am a senior here at Central Michigan University, I play center field and I'm the president of the club team. It's a super cool honor um, being able to lead the club team for Central Michigan um, to play in different teams across the country and just trying to show them like not like my morals or whatever, like what I believe in, like playing hard through all the innings and being a good sport and just like worrying about what we can worry about, like rain outs and stuff like that. We can't do much about weather, but just worrying about showing up each and every day at practice and just enjoying our time. And it's awesome to see them kind of change during the like during the season. So a lot of freshmen and rookies are they're very quiet during the beginning of the year, and you can see them kind of evolve into like the player they want to be. Um, so my advice to any students who have not led before is that you probably already have and just didn't know it. Um, you don't have to have a formal leadership position to be a leader, and I think that's something that's really important. Um, there are four student body presidents in four years, so during your entire senior year experience, like four people have held this position. And, you know, getting this position is difficult, and so... And it it's, may not be what you want to do, um, but you may want to be a leader. And there are so many ways, especially at CMU, to lead. So um, you, you can be a leader in a group project. You can be a leader in an RSO. You can just speak up. And if someone says something to you in class, just like say what's on your mind or like stand up for what you believe in. Um, yeah. I think that we ha do a really good job of allowing people to get that experience and then giving opportunities so you can get involved with the Volunteer Center, with the Honors Program, with the Leadership Institute, with really any group on campus that will fit your needs and what you want to do. And just, I think, if you want a leadership position, like go for it because nothing's stopping you. Um, I've met the widest range of people who hold leadership positions. and it's all been great um, and everyone's different and everyone approaches the leadership position differently so just listen um, and go for it